Regular electricity supply is the prime mover of socio-economic development of any society. Business uplift is unarguably dependent on it. Quest for alternative sources of electricity have given a boost to the sale of power generating sets, which many believe may have encouraged rise in the prices of goods and services. Business owners who commented on the situation noted that poor power supply has adversely affected their businesses, thereby frustrating their ability to efficiently respond to their responsibilities. They consequently called on the federal government to swing into action towards making life meaningful for them. Committed to douse the pains resulting from poor electricity by the Benin Electricity Distribution Company, Edo State Governor Mr. Gordon Obaseki initiated the Oceoma Power Plant to mitigate the situation, particularly in government establishments. This measure has no doubt promoted efficiency in the discharge of duties by officials in the affected departments. Business owners at the premises of Edo State Council of the Nigerian Union of Journalists are currently enjoying the governor's gesture. Chairman NUJ Edo State Council, Comrade Festus Alenghe, bared his mind on the gains of the Osomo plant project. As we speak now, virtually all the government uh, institutions and all the government facilities have been connected to this uh, private power supply that has been supplied by Osomo power plant. And that was facilitated by Edo State Government. So other persons in this country and other institutions should come to Edo State and ask, how did you do it? And I'm sure if you are able to put them through this epileptic power supply in Nigeria, it will be a thing of the past. Well, in Nigeria today, we can be surprised that the power supply is so epileptic. Then we want federal government to pick up their responsibility. Efforts to obtain comments from authorities of the Benin Electricity Distribution Company on plans to address the poor power supply were unsuccessful. Justin Egmont, EBS News.